the first letter indicated that 100,000 will be given to the operations of the office and 200,000 uh, US dollars will be given to the traveling of the brave gladiators. However, the money that we have re received, we only received 100,000 US dollars for the operations of the office and 100,000 US dollars for the brave gladiators. So we have pointed out that error to FIFA and they have written a new letter to us and they have corrected that uh, what they have stipulated in the letter of the 28th of February. The first letter has uh, caused a commotion and we are unundated with calls from the, from the national team players. They, they think that we received a lot of money, but that is not the case. However, FIFA was not convinced with the financial statement of the association and as such the world football body is asking for an audience between them, the NFA Secretary General, NFA Finance and IT Managers and a representative of the NFA Audit and Compliance Committee for more clarity. We are going to have the meeting. We, we want to, to meet the, our auditors first uh, before we have the conference call with the FIFA people because we also want them to clarify. Only after such a meeting, which is yet to be set, will FIFA make further payments, of which the due date is July. While FIFA and CAF promised to pronounce themselves on the roadmap for Namibian football by the end of January, both entities are yet to do so. We did not receive anything. However, for, for the sake of our members, so we are going to write to them just to hear again from them. This is after two rounds of assessment on the overall situation of local football.